Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Kelly, and if you're new, welcome. I just hopped out the shower, so my hair is clean and up in like this little knot thingy. But I want to jump into today's video. I'm going to be doing a review on Cantu. I know it's been a long time, but I actually just got this in my last month, or what is it, October? October month's curl box. So I wanted to try it out because they have some new products. One of their products is actually a curl stretcher cream rinse. I'm noticing a trend right now with curl stretchers. You know, a lot of people want length, so um, I like that a lot of brands, a lot of curl brands, that they're doing this right now. So we are going to apply this baby in my hair, and let's see if it works. And we're going to leave this microfiber towel on just so that it doesn't drip down my neck. So I'm just going to section my hair in half, and let's see how good this is. Oh, it's very creamy. Oh, it smells good. I think I put too much. All right, let's see. So just reading the directions, it says apply to damp hair, leave in hair for three to five minutes, then rinse with cool water. So Cantu is curly girl friendly. It has no mineral oil, sulfates, parabens, silicones, you name it. They ain't got it in their, in their product. This is what it looks like. And I put a lot in it, but it's not white. Let me do the other side. Let's clip this up. So we're going to apply this baby and see how she looks. After we apply it, we're going to follow with the Cantu Curling Coconut Cream. And as it dries, I'm just going to leave it down because I'm going to assume that it's supposed to stretch downwards. So we will wait now three to five minutes and I will be back to rinse out my hair. Okay. Woo! Alrighty. My hair is wet. <laughs> And I actually, it, it actually kind of works like a leave-in because you're rinsing it with cool water, meaning it's gonna like lock in everything. You know, it's gonna like seal your hair cuticle and whatnot, so it's actually interesting. All right, now time to put in the coconut cream. What I can say is that Cantu's products always smell good. Um, I'm not always a huge fan, but that's what we're testing out, so. It's very creamy. Elongator. Gotta stay low. You know what? I feel like my hair is too wet. Hold on. Take your microfiber. Alright, last one. I'm like throwing this in my hair, detangling it. Okay, so we have applied all the product inside my hair right now. And last but not least, we're gonna add a Style Stay Frizz Free Finisher. I have never in my life used anything like this kind of product. So this is for weightless hold for curly or straight styles. Non-sticky, okay. Directions, miss from six inches away from, away onto finished styles for hold and control. So I don't know if I'm supposed to do this before or after my hair dries. Okay, wait, so let's read this. Whether you blow dry or air dry, shield your humidity with the ultimate control without crunch. Keep your press longer or your proof in place with the lightweight mist. Made with shea butter. Shea butter. <laughs> this product is made with pure shea butter and formulated to keep your curls curly or straight. Okay, let's go. Six inches, maybe a foot. <laughs> That's all I'm doing right now. <laughs> maybe when my hair dries, I'll see what it's like. I think it's supposed to like, instead of putting a gel, you put like a mist. So. Okay. I'm done. Let's get this day going. Let's air dry for about 80%. Come back, maybe diffuse. We'll see if it needs it or not. And I'll be with you in a moment. <laughs> All right, so we are in the car and it is pouring rain outside. Um, so I didn't choose the best day to do my hair, but hopefully it 
has the opportunity to dry when I'm inside. I don't know. We have a lot of things that we're going to be doing, but we're in my car. That's why it is white. Um, even though it's that dumb. Uh, Jonathan's with me though, but my hair, it is, it's keeping its stretch. So I'm not mad. I don't know how it's going to dry because it's raining, but oh, sorry. We're going into a parking lot and then there's like this car that's blocking us from getting in. Um, we're actually late somewhere course but um yeah so we have a lot of things that we're doing so so far my hair is keeping up though oh and I'm breaking out well yeah so I'll see you in a bit <laughs> so I am home clearly I have my robe on I'm very tired so I'm gonna diffuse my hair it's about 50% dry and it actually doesn't look bad like this is I like the movement of it um I don't feel hardness from that spray which is nice um, but there is hold, uh, frizz, there's a little frizz, but I'm going to assume that's because it was raining outside. So I'm going to diffuse and I'll be back with my results. You know what? It's been a minute since I have showed you in good lighting. So before I diffuse, okay, I don't know how good, oh, no, 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 this is good. This is good. This is not bad, but my curls look really good actually. Like, oh, hold on. This is not bad. This is. This is nice. I really hope that it dries really good when I put the diffuser on. I'm going to diffuse on low and cool. So it's going to take a while, but I'm trying to avoid as much frizz and I want this to last me days because I don't want to wash it again. So I'm not too mad. I'm not too mad. All right, I'll be back. Okay, so we're dry. Mmm. Yeah, so I think I was right. Coconut oil or coconut doesn't really work well with my hair. My hair feels very... I'm about to turn on the light. Coconut oil makes my hair very greasy. Like, my fingers are oiled up. Maybe. I keep on thinking of, like, maybe if I did something differently. You know, maybe if I did this. Maybe if I did that. But, like, maybe right now I'm thinking, maybe if I just let my hair air dry a little longer because I liked it. Um, it would air dried nice, but I am feeling so much oil and product in my hands. Not really enjoying it, and my hair feels very, like, there's not as much movement as when it was wet. Like, look. <sighs> Alrighty, so, the elongate, okay, so now let's talk about the elongator. Alright, because right now I was talking about the product, but I think the elongator was actually kind of nice like the way that it felt the heaviness when I applied it and then what it was cool water it like felt good um but I think it's the product that I put on next like afterwards is what like did it to me like this is how I remember my hair feeling when I tried it out before uh yeah this product I have to give away because it does not work with my hair but hopefully the next curl box that I try out is a lot better and will work good for my curls you know if coconut oil doesn't work for you let me know in the comment section below yeah because I don't think I'm alone on this I don't even know what to do with my hair right now you know what we're just gonna go like this okay but that'll do it for this video this was a very I feel like this was short and sweet it's a short and sweet video I kind of got to the point I didn't do too much so I'm actually going to go take a nap. So I will see you guys in next week's video. Love you. Subscribe if you're not subscribed down below. And have a great day. Bye.